All right, out again for a walk with these lads. All right, all right. We're going to head up towards Coniston, old man. I thought we were going to go up to that swirl house and go and have a look at the landing gear and what have you. Just park up there, hopefully it'll be all right. Head off this way, let's go. There's all the locals chilling out early morning. Yeah. Haven't even getting up to get the breakfast yet, look at that. Yeah. Stunning. Last time I was in this area, I was with uh, Johnny and Steve Pat. Getting some photos of this with the bridge. Up and down, but you can see the hills where we hadn't known now in the distance up the top. Just staying there, as you walk it up. The clouds below the, the top of the hills, so it would have been really nice up there now. Been a nice inversion, but uh, a bit further up. Yeah, you can just see it's up there. How nice is that look? Did you get a machine? Yeah. Put them out and you don't want to come down. Yeah. <laughs> How exactly? Oh, the old mine workers. Couple of mines. Nice little place. Let's see if we're going to end up round there and look that way on. Very nice morning for it. I think I'm going to have to take, me, take the skin off. I'm getting rather warm. There's the boys getting photos of the whale. <laughs> it's really nice round there. It's steeped in history. Definitely worth a come and have a butchers if anyone wants to come up this way. I think just up round there. There's actually another bit of a, an infinity pool where people go for a dip. Oh this is it, you go for a dip, John, look at oh Get your head under that waterfall there. Yeah, I like them, eh? Really nice. Oh, there's water. And sweat. There's Sean, think I'll change the profession, becoming a miner. Yeah. Can't get in though. Can't get in. I'm going to go in for an interview and a trial. Yeah. But can I get in? No room with the in. Yeah. A bit higher up now. Welcome to you. Leavers Water's just around the corner now. Well, nearly made it to Leavers Water. Just the other side of that wall there. A couple of tents just up there, just in the clog. It's surprising how warm it is to be honest to say. It's not really that sunny, it's a little bit overcast. Actually, we're actually getting into clog now. But by Christ, still really warm. All of us have to take the skin off. The guy's falling up the rear. Still, that is, it's like mill pond. Look at the stunning. Oh, so it'll be nice to camp along this stretch here it where it's flat. And John will be up, he'll be able to go for a dip. Hey, John. Straight in. Neighbor there. How oh, nice is that look with a bit of mist over it? Sits on the top of the it looks absolutely amazing. Wish I had my camera with us now. Camps outside of like Poundland, is that? Right, made it so far up now. Crowned that one there. Mini old man. Looks like it's starting to lift over there. Looks, looks like that cloud's starting to get a bit higher. Oh, there's a few tents over there, John, yeah. look there. Yeah. Hopefully it'll burn through. Let's head a bit further up here and around there. Get the end of the prison band, and then up on the swirl house. Yeah, uh, get a bit further up. See the prison band just up there. There's the sun coming out now. And there's a camper just there. I think that's about five or six campers we've seen in this area now. Get up there. I bet you what when we get up there, should be able to see over towards the Langdales. Uh, we're not far from the top now. Swirl Hall's just the top of here. And there's a prison band. It takes us up. What oh, the Swirl House. Oh, nice when we get up there. And you know, I quite like that prison band. It's not a bad walk up there. First time you ever walk down that, about a week later, I was just saying to the lads, I seen on YouTube a video of a guy mountain biking down there. It's unreal where people go on the bikes. Brilliant. <laughs> I think it's starting to clear there now. You can actually see great cars. 
Just come up back down there. Yeah. Absolutely amazing. Still looking a bit hazy over towards Coniston Water itself. But this has lifted quite a bit since we've been walking from Leavers Water. So hopefully by the time we get up the prison band on the top of there, it might lift that a little bit higher. Really nice. How nice is that there? Uh, wow. That's where we're going to go. There's a path up the prison band. Jeez. That way it takes you around to Weatherlam. And if I'm not mistaken, if we come over here, I'm not too sure whether we'll be able to see the body of the plane. I think that might be down here somewhere. I can't see it, I might be lying. <laughs> There's a lad coming I'll up now. I'm just seeing, seeing videos of somebody biking down this. No way. Hard to believe. Oh. But if you go on YouTube, there's actually videos of people coming down this on a bike. On a bike. Just trying to keep an eye out for the body of the plane. I'm sure it's down here, but I can't see. It looks like this is a bit just over well, on the hillside the there. The but we can't see fully down the valley, so I'm sure it is down there where the part of the body of the plane is. <laughs> They don't get ready to throw us off a tension with steep way. Well, to top of the prison band. Oh, first way in right. That's where I was. Got into the clog again. So I was hoping to try and see the, the body of the plane down there. But the clog's coming, so... I say that's still clear over there. Oh, we found it. It's just in the rocks there. This is the top of Swirl House, this one here, mate. Hi. Swirl House here. Great cars over there. The landing gear is just there. This way? Just oh. over there. That's another way and right just over there, but we're not going to do that one. We're just going to go round onto great cars, see the landing gear, yeah. and head over towards <laughs> Old Man from here. See, so we keep getting glimpses. It's just coming there now, but it keeps sort of dis dissipating a bit so we can still get a decent view. October the 22nd, 1944. Second way in right of the day. Great cars. Morning. I'm going to touch it, even though I've been up here a few times in the past. Really nice. So the clag keeps coming in over the tops. See Scarfell, Scarfell Pike are over there. There you can see there's Leavers Water now. You can see the path where we came up there. Came up the side there, up towards the prison band. Coniston in the distance there. See where Brimfell, the next part. We're over here and up onto Brimfell. An old man and back down the other side. The paths you let me get on this camera, but I can see the pathway is down the other side. And we're all the way back down. I think we want to go for a pint at the, at the Lion in Coniston when we get down. The lads are just standing there admiring the views over this way. It's really clear this side. Looks really nice. See all the way out towards Sellafield and Whitehaven. Uh, just looking back to where we've come, came up the valley there. See Swirl House there. Great cars the other side. Walked along down and up here. Brimfell, just a bit further over here. And on to uh, Old Man Coniston. There you go, approaching Brimfell just here. And top of that up over there, Old Man Coniston. So we'll get to this one. Touch the top of this, this is me number three of the day. It's another way right over there. There's a lad's chilling out behind us. Number three. Which one's this then? Brimfell. And that's the old man up there? That's the old man there, straight in front of us. Yeah, look at the views there now. You see fully where we came up there. So the mine works up. 
or path from there down. You see it's zigzagging down here, down the, the tarn and down round, falling back over. Probably pointing in totally the wrong way there, by the way. So I don't know. I can't really see on the screen. Hey, two, some people are going in that tarn, isn't there? Yeah, so there's an old man there now. So old pathway down. There was water. I'll do the side, prison band up on. It's where I was. Right, that's all man of Coniston done. The guys come down there, stop and have a sandwich. So next stop, the bull for the sherbet. <laughs> the bull. Start this descent very sleepy and loose. So I'll just be taking steady down here. I'm quicker on the uphills than I am on the downs, to be fair. See Coniston water down there now looking really nice. It's a little bit hazy though. Yeah, there's a lot of people coming up today. A surprise, absolutely beautiful day for it. The guys think they've took the wrong turn because the path's that rough. I'll be getting beat up at the bottom, I'll not be getting a pint. Well, I've done most of that descent now. Most of the worst bit anyway. It's sort of not so bad now, but some of that down there. Just take it out, take its toll on your knees when you're coming down that, you do feel it. We'll get out to this town here and then head back down the mines, not too bad. See the old divorce there, old man of Been a few people in for a swim. John's devastated and he hasn't brought his towel. I've got my shorts. He's still tempted to go in and just his uh, undercrackers and just drip dry, yeah, John? I've got my shorts. <laughs> then we're going to go down this way and head back down. See all the old mine workings now. A bit further down, you can see some more signs of cables and that of the old bridge of transport stuff up and down. Yeah, at least see, the, to see all the offices. I think one of them's actually got a sign up here in office. I'll show you when we get out of it. See all the old workings there. Some of the old machinery and things are there about. Yeah, I made it so far down now. We're gonna hang a left, go around here, and take us back down to the opposite side of the river we came up on, and get down to where the car is. Been years since I've walked this. I think the first time I come up, I come down here with Nathan. So that was about six years ago. So I'm still a bit fuzzy about where the path actually goes. We'll see. Don't know if we make our look all that. You see the waterfalls there, just below. Lever's water, looks lovely. There's John the gatekeeper. Conservation area, Copper Mines Valley. Right, this path now looks like it's going to be a bit of a tick fest, so we'll try and keep out the ferns as much as we can. Can't be bothered with them things. The absolute nightmare, we had the dog with us now running around in there. Yes, how nice is this? Back to the bridge. Right, we've made it back down. I'll just drop the bags off in the car, so now we know what that means. Be your time. It's a black bull for a sherbet. <laughs> this way. Lads <laughs> having a drink. Well right, there's a nice pint there in the Black Bull, same as always. So I'm going to head back to the car now and head home. So until the next one, see you later.